Food is a necessity. It's nourishment that we all need to live and survive. 95% of us in South Central uh, knows very well that this is a food desert, and I know very well that there's already a lack of resources here. So that compounded by the crisis of corona, I thought, you know, food would be the gesture that made sense. I think maybe three or four years ago, I became super committed to this idea of having a community center in my neighborhood for children and young adults that would support all sorts of intelligence for free at a very high level. When Corona became a thing and I realized that it would be impossible to open the community center as I had planned, initially I thought how cool it would be to go on a mini art vacation in my studio and experiment mm -hmm. with concrete and foam. And about two days, three days into it, it felt a little off and it felt like irresponsible a little bit to you know, dream up these beautiful images, um, representations of South Central, um, and that it made most sense to actually get to work. There has to be this other side of my practice that is about a tangible action and redistributing resources, uh, material, in a one-to-one -one way that's not about a representation of South Central in an art object. So I thought, let's fill people's refrigerators and keep them fed. And I reached out to a friend from childhood that I went to middle and high school with, Karina, who has a background in food sustainability and environmental law and has been, you know, plugged into farmers markets in LA since for as long, at least a decade or so. And we've been tapped in with really beautiful, like local farmers for the past few weeks. We always have pineapple. We always have squash. We always have kale. We always have mixed lettuce heads. We always have citrus. We always have raspberries, strawberries. Always have mango, herbs, basil, chives. Just some of everything. Literally some of everything, yeah. It's gotten so amazing that now we have like a line of cars, people waiting for us. Yeah, very excited about the quality. Very excited that everything, you know, was harvested, you know, a few days ago. That it came from a farm, that it's from farm to Watts. Mm -hmm. um, very excited about the consistency. And so a lot of the conversation that I have, you know, with folks on foot or in the car, I see you next week, da, 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 and you know I will. And that's been really beautiful.